good day it's um located at uh, Glan it's a uh, barangay barangay Ned uh, no barangay uh, um gomasa Glan Sarangani province uh, we have a lot of topic today it's a uh, a blog uh, you know Rosal uh, Resort Rosal. I love Rosal well uh, it's uh, quite uh, a tourist uh, heaven uh, the owner of this establishment is maybe a family business the original occupants or the native lumen of this uh, town long time ago uh, it's uh, oh not uh, yeah it's also part of uh, South Cotabato South Cotabato where I was born at uh, the town of Banga but it was uh, slice off from South Don't disturb me. <laughs> I'm looking forward to me. <laughs> April 4, April 5, 2021. Today is April 5, 2021. The 34th birthday of Jam, my daughter, my second child. This is Rosal. As I have said, this uh, is a uh, property owned by uh, Adarna, family Adarna. What's up, Mia? Get a dula, dia. Na kaunsa siya? Ha? Ayo, di siya maligo. This is amazing part. I haven't seen this uh, structure when I was a kid because we were inland, not uh, the shoreline. So if this were plants before and became fossils, oh, maligo na ako So it's amazing, amazing. This became rock. Yeah? Rock solid. Huh? Because of uh, transformation like corals. Nagsigi mo naghilak. Uh, we own this place today because Hello uh, Dao? We were alone here. Only few occupants. Ano may mana nga naga hilak mana siya? 
Ala ala ala. Pasagdi lang pahilaka lang na dia. Pati na. Oh, eh wala ay. Oh, sige na ligo na mo, ligo na mo. Ligo na, ligo, ligo, ligo. Ligo, ligo. Dali, dali nga, maligo at na. Dali, dali, dali. Kuyog na, kuyog. I'm doing my video selfie, you know. If you want to know how to operate a video selfie alone, Only my fingers holding that phone. See, I can do a vlog and then show my face. Oh, like storytelling. Ah, ngayong araw, day, I can just reminisce what happened. That part there is. I think the white habit owned by Dr. Dr. Ernie Adarna and this is the sister I think Noemi or something and that's also their property there this the other part is Kuku Beats oh yeah that's also the original owner of this land it happened that uh, they were able to retrieve back their properties from so-called uh, squatter or illegal occupants uh, they have a fierce court battle until uh, the occupants uh, surrendered the property to them with a hefty price uh, they were paid uh, maybe so that they can regain their or own back their properties here it's a seizure of land no? it's still connected with the uh, mainland Mindanao as I have said it's part of uh, South Cotabato then 20 or more plus years I remember uh, the governor is uh, uh, was uh, governor Sergio Morales who used to campaign in this area and uh, uh, that area there the Masim Masim Kiamba so it's part of South Cotabato now it's a uh, Sarangani, Sarangani province. It's a Boracay, Boracay. Yeah, it's a white sand, Boracay. You can enjoy coming here. You just book uh, Rosal Beach. Just book and visit us here. Alam mo, malit pa ako. Alam ko na nung lugar eh, kaya lang mahirap. It's hard to come here. Because the... Uh, rough road eh, mahirap eh ngayon madali na ano ginagawa ang 4 lanes na the road or the connection from Jensen it's it's undergoing from Jensen it's an hour and a half or a travel so you can come here easily with that improvement uh, of the highway of the road uh, when we used to come here uh, way back 20 years ago or something oh yeah we had a hard time coming here with my kids oh yeah with the small kids uh, my uh, eldest then was only 10 years old oh. but uh 
the only place where we can unwind them. Unwind by the seashores. Um, well, uh, come to think of it, I was uh, I grown up at the inland part of South Cotabato, passing by Jansan towards Marbel, then Banga. Banga is my hometown, my birthplace. Luckily, we were brought up uh, under, uh, maybe, by the influence of my mother, um, the Anson family from Dao Capis. Marami tayong pag-usapan ngayon. Ah. It's my time. I'm only alone here, you know. Nobody from Rusal Beach taking a bath dipping into the waters of this beach oh uh, well uh, religious family but we had uh, I remember no electricity when I was a kid at five we had to we had to uh, take our supper dinner then by six o'clock yeah we hit the bed so hard really hard in 1960 no proper uh, medical attention and the road uh, is so uh, bad especially during rainy season Luckily, my mother, who is also a high school graduate of uh, TNCHS or Cordell High School before, and a singer, champion singer from Marbell, a good singer. Then she was hired after high school as a regular performer of uh, DX. MD or something in Davao City. There they uh, she met my father as mechanic, vehicle motor motor mechanic in a certain shop there, and, uh, and they were um, I think board mate or something. That was my early fifties. Uh, my father also came from. Of, of course, the original route is the now Cebu. Then, maybe due to hardship there, they went to migrated to Ormoc. Then, my father was born in Ormoc, and due to another hardship there, because of the prodding and the invitation of uh, the promised land, the past. Uh, Open land, vacant land, and unexplored land or uncultivated land in the Philippines. They came over. All the Magan family uh, after the war were, were able to land or settle at Tampakan, where today is the uh, having a gold rush or second to Africa so large deposits of gold and precious metal there silver gold but they left that place late 40s they left uh, Tampakan Liberty Barangay Liberty my mother was also um, reached Marbell 
before the war. Then the uh, war broke out, so uh, she spent her childhood in the presence of Japanese Japanese imperial uh, soldiers, armies. Uh, that's before the war. But the perilous travel from Panay uh, is beyond, uh, was beyond the description. They took the, well, the motorized uh, banka or something boat to, from Dao Capis, I don't know, where, where they, uh, they pass or their route to Cotabato City then boarded the wooden uh, balsa or banka uh, at age uh, my mother at age five or six then uh, they uh, suffered uh, dehydration and uh, starvation while uh, traveling from uh, Cotabato City, Cotabato City to Buluan, Lutayan, uh, passing through uh, crocodile and wild animals infested Rio Grande de Mindanao. Then on foot from Lutayan, they reach Marbel. Oh, that's the story of my mother. And they became the pioneer, pioneer settler of Marbel, together with the Grupo family, Igasan family, Chanson, Kapondan. Yeah, they are all our relatives from Dao Capist. Sanchez, the grandmother of Governor. Jun Tamayo of South Cotabato. He is my nephew. Her low lower grandmother is the cousin of my mother. Best friend then. Uh, from Dao Capis. Playmates at that. So, uh, yeah, this is Mindanao. I grew up, uh, luckily, with a uh, uh, nice, uh, loving parents. My mother is a hard-working mother. Uh, uh, she sleeps late at night and uh, woke up early morning to do her job as a businesswoman. Oh yeah, buy and sell only. Simple uh, buying rice, corn, then milling the rice or corn sheller, then sell it that out. Sells it to Jensen from Banga or sometimes Marbel uh, at Coradal Products, uh, Ruby Enterprises of Jensen. Copra products from coconut so we're able to study so that supported us supported our education and we went through college except uh, our eldest who was not uh, able to make it uh, had his diploma. All four siblings except one had a license. College. Oh yeah. Oh. So I started uh, going to school. But my, uh, 
but my uh, stay in Davao is uh, University of Mindanao is in Davao only it lasted for one year because my brother then was also graduating from high school so we both uh, transferred to Cebu to start our formal college uh, I was uh, miraculously introduced to Veles College where Cebu Institute of Medicine uh, is located also same building same owner My sister and my youngest brother were enrolled at the University of San Carlos. During the time that uh, there was a high, that was the uh, time where there was the Christian Moral War. So part of the decision to go transfer to Cebu is to was to for us to be safe. Case uh, a full uh, war uh, breaks out to protect us. Well, our family is not that uh, uh, wealthy. Uh, it's maybe the design of God that. We are not experiencing experience experiencing hardship. Uh, we uh, had our property not totally owned by us, but no, no, no. Um, we purchased our property not by cash like uh, the trucks and wheelers or something um, especially brand new it's uh, we paid it monthly basis and then gradually our rice mill grew and the uh, business also were one of the originals from that town to engage in business so that was a lucky part of my uh, travel, my journey. Uh, my father also is uh, 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 held the position as the chairman of the barangay and also inherited uh, as pioneer from Ormok Pioneer. Uh, of Banga and Sorala so they were given 12 hectares per family and then uh, also the kids were also given uh, uh, hectares of land as pioneers of Banga and Sorala so that's where our livelihood uh, during our childhood for my part oh yeah my goodness uh, it's hard because i uh, was so busy with barcadas friends uh, i used to sing in a club i used to that's my hobby singing so Sometimes my time was divided to, uh, while I was going through college studies and uh, staying at the bar, nightclub. Well, anyway, uh, it's history. Then uh, I became full-fledged, full-fledged 
medical doctor, physician. And so hard in order for you to earn money, you have to be a specialist or a teaching That's my practice, anesthesia. Then my wife also is a radiologist, trained in Cabo uh, Medical Center. That's another miracle for me. But it's not an easy task. Sleepless night, just like studying medicine. Sleepless night, hardship, attending to patients, critical, surgical patients. Thank you, Lord, for the talent. Until now, I'm still okay. I'm 62, going 63 years old. Of course, my life is not uh, that uh, easy. I hold, I held back tears. I uh, harbored uh, the ultimate secret of the family. But I survived. I just maybe ask God to be a good boy, a good person. Not to destroy the name of our family. I protected everything. Kung sa Bisaya pa, I'm bebot. Kung sa Bisaya, buot, bebot, buot ang. I don't know, maybe. Because I'm a prayerful kid, I don't uh, disregard the presence of God. God is existing, protecting, creating, guiding our journey in life. If you think that you are smart, a professional, a wealthy person, and then you depend on your abilities, no. Still, you have to give back the honor and glory to whatever you have. Whoever you are, give back that honor and glory to God. I'm... Uh, yeah. I am very thankful for the Lord God the Almighty for everything he has done. Yesterday is, uh, was an Easter Sunday. We believe that someone up there sent somebody, a humble person, the person of Jesus Christ who became a man. Jesus means... Uh, Savior. Uh, kahit na anong pang gawin nyo. Uh, no matter how you destroy the name of Jesus, it's really, really a good example of a human. Humble. Just read the Bible. It's complete. Uh, all our thinking, behavior, attitude, it's found in the Bible. They are found in the Bible. Our decision. It's found in Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Psalms, and the history. Oh my God. Jesus' birth was predicted or prophesied by uh, prophesied by prophet Isaiah. Many more thousands of years before Jesus was born. So it's not a joke compared to other self-proclaimed prophets. Self-proclaimed prophets. Oh, no, it's uh, that prophet is uh, a worldly prophet. After Jesus, God also had that uh, theophany. He sometimes, God uh, sometimes show uh, us His presence, actual presence. 
and show that to a certain person like we believe a prophet too. There are prophets who experience theophany or Christophany but do not presume that you were the one. You are maybe chosen by God to act like Jesus. Just act like Jesus. Be humble. But you're not God. You're not supposed to say that God and you are the same. No. No, that's business. Then, uh, most of those people, uh, prophets, self proclaimed prophets, were intelligent. They can put up, they can write their minds, they can write their thinking and make their own laws. And maybe a religion for that matter to guide their flocks or their followers. But they deviate from the teaching of the Bible they um, almost uh, brag or pretend that uh, they can uh, they have uh, a good communication with God but it's not that's worldly there they one there was one prophet who became warrior and their members love guns ammunition oh that's uh, not uh, from god it's a worldly thing so uh, be careful This is video selfie. My hands, my left hand is holding the the cell phone. April five. April five, twenty twenty one. God bless us all. Ingatay May COVID pa. Take your vaccine shots. That's the ultimate. Uh, thing to do it's a flavor of the century uh, maybe you have, will be given a travel be, travel visa or you're allowed to go around with that kind of shots anyway it's uh, not uh, yet complete because we only have that emergency use utilization uh, still undergoing the study is still undergoing uh, to make it perfect for the children for the pregnant women and uh, all ages but it's uh, giving us combat uh, the uh, coronavirus infection submit yourselves to vaccination COVID vaccine and pray and pray to God for protection thank you for following for watching for uh, everything connecting with me
Be a good person. Be humble. Connect with the DXKI of Cordal City. 1062 kilohertz. DZAS. Uh, click that on Facebook. FEBC. Uh, stick to that stations. Listen or watch them on Facebook. All their programs. Wag na kayo makinig dyan sa mga nagpro-programa na parang do not listen follow those person those person who so worldly follow the station that is so heavenly directing us heavenward nakay ma Holik dire, nakan holik dire isda. Kung sa may makuha ni mo karon, kung ha? Pero nai isda gya pon dire. Ah, inun-unan lang. Pero lingaw kayo. Mao ba? Taka dire pon ka dili. Ah, mao ba? Taka North Cotabato. Oh, kuya oi. Asa sa ko North Cotabato. Kuya oi ni dadha ra bay lungguri. Oh, ilunggo mo ko. Ilunggo ba ito? Nakawa daw kasi yung hulik ba eh. Uy, naman lagi. Uy, guwapo. Oo, lagi, lagi. Oo, nalaligo. Oo, ayayo. God bless. Hindi lang taga Surigao ang nakarating dito eh lahat. Maginda na oh, North Cotabato, Zamboanga, Davao. Just to taste or have that experience of Gumasa. White sand beach here. It's so popular. So, this is all. I'm up. I have to travel back to our place few minutes or a few hours from now thank you for watching wala na kay kuyong ligo gitugnaw na ko gitugnaw na ko Ma dili dili pero maligo na ko sa fresh water dili oi kinsa may sulti ninyo mo ulit ah oi uli ay Dere ka? Dere ka? Daghan lagi lahi pa. Lagi? Masig mahulog bigla. <laughs>